Welcome and good morning. Thank you for joining us for this week's Market Outlook, brought to you by iTrader.com. Swiss Re is switching the entire 130 billion it holds in liquid assets to track ethical indices, the latest move towards principled investments by the insurance industry. The euro has ticked higher in the Thursday session despite the German factory orders, which gained 1%, well short of the forecast of 1.9%. Crude oil prices may rebound after suffering the largest loss in a month as the EIA reports a larger than expected weekly inventory outflow, echoing private sector estimates. The Aussie dollar pair trades positively since morning to move above 0.7604. No change on the bullish bias. The dollar yen pair continues to fluctuate around the 113.00 level. We notice that the stochastic gets rid of its negativity clearly to reach the oversold areas. The price of silver returns to push negatively on the 16.00 level in an attempt to confirm breaking it, which supports the continuation of the expected bearish trend. The price of gold shows slight bearish bias in an attempt to move away gradually from the 1,229.32 level to keep the bearish trend valid. The Japanese Eco Watchers survey will be released on Monday at 5 a.m. Greenwich Mean Time. The German Exports, Monday at 6 a.m. Greenwich Mean Time. The U.S. Labor Market Conditions Index, Monday at 2 p.m. Greenwich Mean Time. The Eurozone's industrial production will be released on Wednesday at 10 a.m. Greenwich Mean Time. The Canadian Interest Rate Decision, Wednesday at 2 p.m. Greenwich Mean Time. And the U.S. Retail Sales, Friday at 12.30 p.m. Greenwich Mean Time. Thank you for joining us for Sunday's Market Outlook. On behalf of all of us here at iTrader, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to log into iTrader.com for all of your trading needs. Your personal account manager is ready to answer all of your questions.